Welcome to this lesson on Cavalieri's Principle. So let's think about this problem first. Below are two stacks of quarters, and each stack has six quarters each. The stacks are the same height. Do these stacks have the same volume? Why or why not? So go ahead and pause the video now and answer this. Okay, so before I tell you the answer, let's go ahead and complete these notes and then we'll come back to this question at the end. All right, so let's talk about Cavalieri's principle. So Cavalieri was an Italian mathematician in the 1500s and he discovered that if two solids, so two three-dimensional shapes, have the same height and the same cross-sectional area cross-sectional area at every plane parallel to the base the solids will have the same volume so what in the world does that mean well they have the same height that's easy two shapes that have the same height but cross-sectional area let's talk about that so a cross-section is the shape you get when cutting straight through a three-dimensional shape so think about a 3d shape if you cut straight through and you open it up and look at the shape that is made, that is the cross section. So if we took this cone and we cut off the top and we looked at the bottom of the top, it would be a circle. All right, same thing for this prism. So it looks like this is a square. So if we cut this prism in the middle, then both, sli both sides or both faces where we have cut would be a square. And then for a cylinder, if we cut off right here and we're cutting straight across, not at a slant, and we looked at where we cut, that would be a circular shape. So that's a cross section. And then when it says parallel to the base, that means we're cutting straight across. We're cutting straight through. We're not cutting at a slant. Okay, so let's go back to Cavalieri's principle. So if two shapes have the same height and they have the same cross-sectional area, so basically if we took a slice off of each, would they have the same area? So let's go back to these coins. So these coins, there's six in both, so they would have the same height, check. Cross-sectional area means basically if we take one coin off the top of each, and these are both quarters, and we looked at the area of those quarters, would they be the same? Well, they're both quarters, so of course the area and the area would be the same. So these would have the same volume. So if you, has, you said yes at the beginning, you were right. And the reason is because, one, they have the same height, and they have the same cross-sectional area, meaning every quarter has the same area. Okay, so let's look at this example. So these two solids have matching cross-sectional areas, which means if I sliced here and I sliced here, they would be the same area at every plane parallel to the base. Do they have the same volume? Okay, so we have cross-sectional area, check. Right here it tells us they are both seven inches tall, so they have the same height. So that would be a yes, they have the same volume. Even though they don't look the same, it doesn't matter. As long as those two criterion are met, they will have the same volume. And that is what Cavalieri's principle is all about. All right, so you can go ahead and stop the video now and complete Cavalieri's principle practice and check it with your teacher.